For a hanging leg raise alternating sides, you have a few options of how you could do this. So one option, which would be where I recommend you start if you have access to this, is with a captain's chair. The captain's chair is going to allow you to have your back against a cushion, your feet hanging off the floor, and your arms bent and supported by cushions. Usually you're holding onto a handle as well. That's gonna help to keep you stable as your legs are lifted and you're moving them around. If you don't have access to a captain's chair, but you do have access to something else that you can hold onto and hang off of, great, you can still do this. That's gonna be a harder option, so you can also advance from the captain's chair to this option. You can also use a tricep stip bar to push yourself up off the floor, hang there, and then move your legs. That's gonna to be tough as you're holding yourself up with your arms. So you can advance from captain's chair to this and then to that tricep dip bar as well. Okay, so for this exercise, wherever you are doing it, you're going to be needing to be raised up off the floor. So for me with this low door, I'm going to let myself start to hang with my knees bent and now engage my core. So wherever you are, squeeze your glutes and slightly tuck your tailbone forward to engage your core. Extend your legs straight and just slightly in front of wherever your body is hanging from. Now from here, inhale and exhale. Tuck one knee up toward your chest, lower down, inhale. Exhale, other side, inhale down. Now you will notice if you are just hanging without support from the captain's chair, your body might want to sway back and forth. It's really important that you keep your core engaged and move slow with this so that you can maintain stability without rocking forward and backward. 